All right, guys, if you don't think that the plagues are going on, I am going to show you. There is hell going on in different places in the world, including the U.S. and Ghana. Um, so four communities in Karachi, East, um, I cannot pronounce that municipality. I don't know if I said that right. Have suffered from a rare hailstorm accompanied by strong winds that ravaged property, killing a girl and scores of domestic and wild animals. It goes on to say, um, he said the cost of damage estimated at 250,000 Ghana cities and with a total of 106 houses having their roofs peeled off, displacing 837 people. The affected persons are temporarily staying in churches and with family members awaiting support to reaffix their dwellings. He said that his cousin alone found 17 rabbits in the bush. with several inhabitants in the disaster areas, the winning bush lottery, an indication that the hail of the hailstones could be larger than normal. He called for the urgent attention of the municipality champions and solicits for relief to alleviate the suffering of the people. Material support is being sought for the affected people with a special appeal, NADMO, relief agencies, NGOs, and philanthropists to come to our aid. He said, meanwhile, hailstones for the size of 1.5 centimeters in diameter collected by some of the residents. The disaster survived three days of storage in open pans and depicted by picture. Okay. He, he discounted the rare phenomenon resulting in the climate change, suspecting that the term of velocity, which varies with size, when the icy lump struck the ground, might be responsible for killing of the animals. Dead one. Um, there also was a hailstorm in the state of Arkansas, and hail of all sizes came down um, last night on 311. Um, now people everywhere are currently um, are working to figure out the costly damages. CS Auto Bodies Pine Bluff encourages those with hail damage to make sure they go for repairs is legit. The one thing you need to make sure is that a reputable shot and see CJ Hoover Saturday. Excuse me, says C.J. Hooper. Saturday, Saturday, severe weather caused concerning storm damage for residents in Jefferson County, so much that C.J. and his wife went to work on their day off. They were nearly baseball size at my house, but other areas seemed to have gotten it worse than we did. He decided to open shop on Sunday, March 11, in response to the hell damage he experienced firsthand. Both his home and car and many of the Jefferson County woke up to broken glass and busted windshields. I've been covering people's windows that need covering and just talking to everybody, letting them know the process of everything. People, Most people don't know how everything works, and I will call the insurance company first. The court family was out to eat when they started to hear the hail pour down outside. It just let loose, and all we could do was hear it. It was hitting the metal roof of all the place that we were eating. Everybody ran out to look, and we saw how big it was. Pool, pool-sized balls of hail cover the ground, Regina Corp said. Her windshield is broken and car damage, and what she estimates to be about 14 dents. I'm sure it's going to be a decent amount to get the dents and windshield back to what it looked like before. Hubbard's main concern is making sure that those communities save vehicles to put on the road. I had one vehicle earlier where hail went through the glass into the speaker and through the trunk, and it was pretty bad, he said. In addition to making the auto body shop legit, double-check the many roofing companies that may appear this week. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. So, again, um, something's definitely going on. Um, from the hail. Shalom.